Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Hot Pot King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. And I'm back showing off this Black Ops 2 Nuketown 2025 controller. I know a lot of people got a couple questions about the mods and how they work. Well, I've been playing with the mods a little bit and oh my goodness. I am so scared to go inside of a public lobby that people will find out that I got a modded controller and that I'm beasting putting up super numbers because of this. So with that being said, let me show you how these mods work and let's start the match. Now, two, one, let's go. Now to show you guys the mods, basically what they told you is, I'm going to show you the actual guy real fast before we go into the game. Now, this is how the mods work. Let's see if you guys can read this right here. Uh, it's not auto focusing. Mm. All right, if you can read to about here, this is the list that I'm going to be going down. Now, they want me to change it to Mod 11, where it's Rapid Fire, Auto Fast Reload, plus Aim. Now, you guys can see from the class that's on the screen, I got the SMR, only got Laser Sight, Full Metal Jacket. If you know what the SMR is, it's a semi-automatic weapon, which means it only shoots one shot. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to load this up. I'm going to put the mod in before I start the match and show you guys how it works. Now, what you have to do is you have to press RT and you have to press the sync button. Now, you have to press it 11 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now, if you notice, see how this button is lit right here? Let's see if you guys can see that. See how the button, the sync button is lit? That means that the mod is on. So, let's go in. Now, first thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to shoot at this car real quick. All right. Now, notice I'm not aiming. I'm not going to do nothing. All I'm going to do is press the RT button. All right. Look at the screen. Look at that. Fully auto and it's fast reloading. Check this out. Crazy, right? Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run across this map real quick. I'm going to see if I can find me another vehicle that I can blow up. Alright. Since we have another vehicle right here, right? This is what I'm going to do. Now, to turn the mod off, they said all you have to do is press the sync button. And the mod will flicker seven times and it will turn off. Just like this. Alright, now the mod is off. Now, the next mod that I want to do is, of course, the mod that everybody probably wants to know about is the drop shot. Now, I'm going to use, let's see, I'm going to use Rapid Fire Drop Shot plus Aim, which is Light Mode 6. Now, that means that we have to press RT, right? All right. After you press RT, you got to press the sync button six times. That's the mode, mode 6. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now, be amazed, y'all. <laughs> This is this is crazy. I, I I'm not gonna lie. This is outrageous. This is crazy, but it works. So I'm gonna just press RT. I'm not pressing nothing else. Look at that, man. Auto drop shot, man. Check that shit out. And it stands you back up. It stands you right back up after you shoot. That is crazy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop shot and try to hit this car and blow it up. All right. So that means I'm gonna press RT, move the analog not doing nothing else even my semi-automatic weapon which is a pistol is fully automatic that's crazy fully auto everything it's nothing you need to worry about here everything is fully auto everything works it even drop shot you if you don't have any more bullets so if you want to get away from a guy like say a guy is close up to you and you know you don't have any more ammo and you know for a fact that it's him or you, you can drop shot and then hit the knife button and catch him on the way back up. You peep that, right? Catch him right back on the way up. That is crazy. This controller right here is out of pocket. I like it. I wish I could keep it, but I can't. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go inside of a match. And I'm going to go up against uh, a couple bots. 
I'm not going to go into the public lobbies. I don't want you guys thinking that this is what I'm into. You know what I'm saying? Just to get a couple kills. Me personally, when I'm playing Black Ops, I am a 19 and 11 type of guy. And I'm comfortable with that. I have no problem with that. That's cool with me. It's the life I live. You know what I'm saying? So, let's get into the next match real quick. Now, to set up the bots, I guess, let's see. Six. Alright, well, I don't know. All right, four and four. All right, recruit. I guess that's just the difficulty. Now let's go in. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reset the mod. If you guys can look at the uh, upper corner real quick. All right, notice the mod is gone. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose drop shot plus auto aim, just because of the simple fact that I'm gonna be playing up against a couple different people. Now just to check it out, just to make sure that the mod is on and working. I'm going to test it out. Alright. See that? See how the mod isn't totally up? I put drop shot and aim. Which means I have to reset the mod. Reset. Then I have to sh press RT and press 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Alright. Now let's try it one more time. Alright. There we go. Fully auto. Drop shot plus aim on a semi-automatic weapon with no select fire remember that y'all I'm not running select fire at all alright now you see this guy right here let's see if I can run up here let's see if we can find anybody alright check that guy out right there tore him up let's move on to the next one let's see if there are any other people around Uh oh, they out there killing each other. Alright. Check out my fingers, y'all. Check out my fingers. My fingers is definitely off the auto aim button. I'm so used to pressing the aim button. It just feels natural, but you don't have to press it. You can really put your hand and cuff it under the trigger. Like you don't even have to use it. You only gotta use one hand for real for real. When you're shooting, that's crazy. Alright, I'm looking for more people. Let's see. It looks like my teammates is cleaning dudes up. I can't even kill nobody. Let me find out where this Larry guy is going. It looks like he knows where everybody is. Oh, he doesn't know where nobody yet. Ah, check me out. Drop shot in. Woo! I ain't even put a sweat. Hold up. Let me let me get him out of here. I don't even know where he's shooting at. He's scared. He's running. Drop shot him. Wonder where everybody else is at. Wanna see how the score streaks go. Oh, somebody's shooting at me. Uh oh, drop shot. Oh, my prone is blocked, but see that? I was able to get back up. Now, I'm going to put the UAV on, and we're about to go to town. And it, it automatically keeps drop shotting you the entire time. This is crazy. Oh, drop shot. Got him. And the, and the funny thing about it is you can get people out of here before your bullets run out on your pistol. Only got one bullet left on this. So you know what? I'm going to switch it out. Oh. Got him. Alright. Now I got another semi-auto weapon. So let's see if I can find any more. Uh-oh. Got him. Drop shot. Hey, yo. Come here, guy. I see you. Don't you run away from me. Oh, look at that. The computer almost killed me. But I got up out of that situation. Alright, now I got an orbital V set. Which means it's about to go down. Alright, 
right, let's see where we at with this one. Oh my goodness. Ah, I died. <laughs> all right, well, I guess you guys can already tell that this controller does work. The mods do work. So I guess the last thing I can say for you guys is that the giveaway video will be out soon. I will give you all the details on how you can get this controller. But this is IKC signing out. Thanks for watching. And I know y'all want this controller. <laughs> Peace.